Bakugan Bra. Who was going Bra? It's Matthew guys here bringing up Bakugan Bow. Plant review for you today. Yes, I know it's been a while. Uh, with all this stuff going on, my, the state being shut down where I live, they are debating on, they are opening up a few locations. There are, there is talk about that. So, I got a cool little item for you today. Um, I recently just, I found this one time. Uh, I didn't pick it up. Because I didn't have the money. But, now that I do. <laughs> I, it is, sorry, just the camera. It is the... Ventus Hyper Dragonoid and Aquas Pandox Bakugan Battle Pack. Uh, my first Pandox, as you always, um, I will be comparing it with Green, uh, just because like I said the, the 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 bodies are basically the same. It's just the heads are different, as my tripod fails me. So you get five Bakugan in. So I already know what they are. You get Ventus Hyper Dragonoid. You get Aquas Pandox. You get Darkest Cubo. Uh, Darkest Cubo, sorry, uh, Darkest Cubo, Arliss, uh, Phaedrus, they have an Ultra one, I've never been able to find it, it's in a 3 pack I'm pretty sure, and then Cindyus, uh, he has Cindyus, they never had a Cindyus Ultra, uh, which is weird, they should have, so they'll go to the back, boom, like I said, uh, the Rush Stadium, again, I have never been able to find it, if anybody has one willing to sell it to me, uh, comment down below and I'll get in touch with you because I really do want this set because I have the other two arenas I've already reviewed those. I just need this one. I've never been able to find it. So pretty cool We're gonna open this up and take a look what's inside here So here we have all the Bakugan out. We have the, the three Bakugan like I said they already mentioned and the two Ultras I will say this out issue uh, they in the packaging the tail is where it's at right here at this segment it's so hard to get done i had little issues with that i was thought we hit the paint and then aqua's pandox it was just cross body so so we have cards in here with a checklist and instructions uh, i will say this i do wish they did the upper other uh evolutions of the bakugan like i would really like to see a um a nilius one that would have been cool um, I know Gorthia never evolved into the show, I'm pretty sure. And then, um, I'm pretty sure, and then, like, I would like to see a Pegatrix, so, pretty cool. And then, instructions, checklist on back, all the Bakugan, boom, which I will be going, in, um, in my next one, I will go through this and see which Bakugan I need, because there is probably about 70 Bakugan I need. Uh, some of these I have, like I do have Diamond Scorpus and Diamond Hydronoid cores. I have had this for like two months now. <laughs> Sorry, two months now I have already viewed it. I do have the uh, the Pyrus Trice uh, uh, and um, Clockwork. Wait, is that what it's called? It's on the bottom. That was um, Ultra. I thought that was Ultra Trino. It is. Hold on. God, I hate when they do this, Miss Prince. It's like the whole Golem Gorin thing. So you see uh, Trisotrops, but it's just Ultra um, Ultra um, Trino because, like I said, right here I have it, and it says Pyrus Trino. So, again, hate that. Don't really care. It's one of those minor details. I found some of these. I found um, where was I? I found the Scorpio stuff. I didn't pick them up. I didn't have the money. I found the other Pandox stuff. I didn't pick them up. I found the Pythion. I've had. I found. I found basically almost all this. I know some of these are done. Like I have all the the Garganoids. I have all of the uh, Dragonoids. I have Oma. I think I no. I'm missing one Hydronoid. I have. Wait, they had a Mantanoid Ultra Diamond? I'm going to look into that because I've never seen a review of that. Yeah, I've never seen a review of that. Um, how core? I have them all. Uh, yeah, I have them all. So basically, I have most of these. Like I said, probably about like 70 bucks I'm missing. Uh, usually, maybe diamonds or just rare versions that I've never found. We have a Pandox, which... Is Pandox the same thing as Goreen? Yeah, it should just be the same thing as the Mold. Yeah, it's just basically the same. Um, they say on the packaging that they're both... Uh, Gorian is a two, I'm pretty sure they say. I can't remember. 
the box just flew away from me. So we have the cards. We'll take a look at the cards. Uh, right here. So we have Dragonoid Ultra. Um, uh, reason why is because we we do have the Evo card in this. We'll get to that later. So you have a uh, orange she uh, uh, magic shield and a um, red fist six hundred B two damage Kubo. I, I will say so Kubo is the most creepy Bakugan because just look at that. Um, how I have them. Every time I pick it up, I just see a Kubo in there. They also have a diamond one. I'm just saying, which I kind of actually want, uh, which is weird. Um, so. Uh, two magic shield, uh, two warrior shield, two damage at seven, uh, two hundred B is seven damage. Wow, Cindyus, uh, such a shame they never did a Cindyus Ultra to my knowledge. Check the list. Yeah, no, I have all the Cindyuses minus diamonds. So, if anybody has a diamond three pack of that, send it my way, please. I will review and shut you out. Oh my god, Jesus, this guy's a tank. Two uh, orange shields, one should be, and then ten damage. Jesus Christ, Phaedrus. Oh, that artwork's cool, but it's not like the Baku guy. I kind of wish that was it, but yeah, yeah. We all know my opinions about the uh, Battle Planet ones versus the Armor Alliance. Uh, Ramble. Uh, two green fists, one hundred B, one damage. If it lands on green fists, five hundred B and five damage. So six hundred B and six damage. Nice. And then Pandox Ultra. Again, it. It's basically the same thing the molding is, just minor details. Um, I will say this though, um I think of I think of Pandox as just Cuba Ultra because like they're both uh they're both bears and stuff, and then we also they also had a in the show they have a Bakugan named Bear. And I say that's the middle Eva, so you have Cubo, Bear, and then Pandox. So it's uh Red Fist, the a Helix. I really like the Helix ones. Four HB and then four damage. Pretty cool. And then we have the ability cards. We have, see, like I said, Hyper Dragonoid Ultra, three dam uh, 300 charge, 900 uh, B, and then five damage. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, fatality. Fatality. Sorry. A fatality, sorry. <laughs> it's a flip card, two damage, uh, two charge, uh, Holt, Arliss, Chaos, or Ventus. That's cool. It has uh, Arliss Pandox and uh, Darkest Cloptor. I've actually found Darkest Club Tour. I never bought it. I don't think they have an Arliss Pandox. Checking the list. <laughs> Some of these I know off the top of it, but Pandox is one of those ones. Yeah, no, yeah, no, they do. They do. They don't even have a diamond one. That's weird. Ooh. I thought that was a, a rare because of the, the font. Because it's not white. Is that a misprint? I think that might be it. I think... This might be a misprint. Hold on. I I don't know if it is because uh like if we compare it to Pandox's like the the font's different. It looks like it's a it was gonna be because if you look at this, if I can get lighting on it, um the 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 text has te uh, is raised but weird. Mysterious Mist, Halt, Arliss, Chaos, and Pyrus. Jesus. Oh, hot cards. Ray of Freedom. Two charge. Three, uh, 300 dam damage to, one uh, to your Chaos Bakugan. Arliss Power. If you have an Arliss Bakugan on your team, draw a card. What is this? Pot of Greed or something? Thunderstorm. Nice. Uh, 200 B. Sacrifice. You may discard a card to reroll your Bakugan. I remember um, Age of Arliss had a ton of reroll cards. I'm just saying. So, pretty cool. We're going to set this to the side. Cores. Core time. What is it? Cortex or something? What is it called? What is that from? I can't remember. So, we have a orange shield. Four. Uh, four inch B of Chaos or Ventus, which we have a both of those on. A helix one for 500, uh, 500 B and minus one damage. Oh, that's okay. You know, there's a lot of cards that can boost your damage. So, that's kind of fun. Magic Shield for 550B. Nice. I have like a handful of those ones. Another Orange Shield for 250B. Nice. A lot of those, too. Like, those are pretty common. Another one for 150B and then one damage. And yes, I'm not using... I'm using a Pokemon mat. It's... Uh, the 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 playmats... Well, not the playmats. The battle arenas are just too big for my desk. So it's like... I'd just rather do this. Or another orange shield. 
Sorry. Orange Shield for 250B. I am working on a design for a custom box on Battle Planet Matt. Um, it will be the logo of my shop, the Baku Bay Shop, which is currently closed right now until um, the whole state lockdown is done and I can go get stuff because uh, right now I can't get a uh, product, I can't get shipping material. So, really, it's kind of inconvenient right now. So, Red Fist for minus four damage. Wow, that's a certified shield. I think that's my only one of that one. Another one for five damage. Oh, Jesus. You land on both of those, you only get one. <laughs> A green fist for 150B and one damage. Then, last but not least, a green fist for two damage. Nice. A lot of damage ones. Very nice. So, we're going to start with the, the Buckingham Balls. We're going to pick Cabo. So, Dark is Cabo. Jesus. Nothing too special about it. Um, Sad. Uh, I kind of wish they did an Ultra Cabo because I kind of would like to see how that work, what that would work because Cabo. Is like human size, but if you give him in the show, you give him a core, he will grow to be like the size of Drago. But yeah, so it's pretty cool. Again, um, I do think of Pandox as just Ultra, but it would have been pretty cool just to see an Ultra Cubba. Where is the arrow? Arrow right there facing that way. Bakugan Bra stands up. It uh, what, what does it remind me of? Um. Oh, God, what was they called? They, they were called... Uh, I'll probably add later when I find it. Uh, Many parts of the arms, but you could really put them either way. So you can just... You have them just out. Uh, no, I don't even know how they... How do they have them in the instruction? So they just have them on the checklist as just up. Just like this, but you can really... like You can just do that, you know? So it's pretty cool. Uh, it, it reminds me of another Bakuna from, uh, Gandalian Vares. One of those, uh, the bunny things with the ears. Uh, like, one of the, like, the one time, like, Bakuna's we saw. That's what it just reminds me of, but yeah. Cindy's, uh, core. I'm not gonna compare them all. I'm not gonna do comparisons with these, because I do have other Phaedruses. Do you have other Kubas? I do have other Cindy's. Sorry. Trying to do that in one breath. So pretty cool, I gotta say, Chaos. I really like what they've done with the Chaos ones of these because I remember the original ones, they're like, they were gray instead of, uh, uh like, white like this. They were kind of worn down. I I'm trying to think of the word. Um, they were a lighter shade of the gray on the Arlos Bakugans. That's what they really were. They were just lighter shades. Um, yeah, I don't have any of my original ones in here in my office. I have them in my room, which I have offhand. I can grab. I can just grab my um, Aranaut with ba uh, with Battle Crusher. That's really it. So pretty cool. Arrow right there. Bakugan Brawl. Again, Sinius Core. Nothing too crazy. As we take a look at them. Nice, nice, nice. We've, we've all seen how this was. B Power right there. Cubbo's by his foot next. Phaedrus, Phaedrus, one of my favorite Bakugan. It was uh, the fir my first, my first um, Phaedrus one. It was the darkest one with, when I got uh, Kimbo's card, which is still amazing to this day that I have his card in my collection. Uh, I hope to get other uh, Baku Masters cards if possible, if they have all, uh, extras, or possibly get my own one day. Maybe Spin Master, please uh, contact me. I have their phone number right there for customer service. Say, hey, sponsor me. Sure, I'm not going to. So pretty cool. You guys know how I feel like of the Arlos Pokemon from Battle Plant, whereas the Armored Alliance ones are the best. Just look at that gold shimmery. Nice. I just had the off hand because all, all the all the the Baku gear ones are just on my printer <laughs> with the the Monster Jam trucks of Drago. So I had the the Fire and Ice one, the Raven one, and the Arlos one. I I've, I've heard they're coming off the new one. I don't know too too uh, for sure. But I've heard rumor that they were going to do another one. Uh, I haven't done videos on this because I really don't know what to do. Like, I tried seeing other videos, but, like, they just, like, compare to the monster drugs. I don't have any other monster drugs. So, um, I probably won't do videos of this. But, yeah. So, arrow right there. Back to John Brawl. You guys know I love the core um, Phaedrus over the Ultra. Because this, to me, is more show accurate a little bit. Because, you know... Uh, because they're not like the toys. They're not like this anymore in Bakun uh, Battle Planet. They, he was like elongated like this. And so to me I really like this. So pretty cool. 
Where's the B power? I forgot what the B power was on this guy. Wait, is it not even printed? Hold on. I have, a f I have one next to me. Oh no. Right there. <laughs> right there. I thought it was on the body. I thought it was on his back. I have the, the vent is one next to me because I, I don't have room. I'm out of storage. So yeah, pretty cool. Long, nice. You guys know how I feel about that. Next, we get on to Pandox. Yes, Pandox Ultra. Again, um, I didn't grab the Aquas Gorgon for some reason. Why didn't I grab that one? I grabbed the Arliss one. So like I said, as you can see, like the mold is basically the same. Um, minus minor detail. As you can see, like... We have a bunch of detail here, whereas here we have it. The head sculpts, um, the arms are literally uh, just different uh, uh, mold in details. Just like I said, basically the transformation is the exact same. Like as you can see, like look at that, arrow is the same way. They stand the exact same way. The feet are not the same. Are literally the same. Just details are different. Like I said, these are basically the same things. So to fold him, like I said, you just put the head down, the thighs, yeah, flip the feet, seize up. We'll, we'll roll the, him and Drago, and then we'll do my final thoughts, which I have a few final thoughts on these, on this one. Boom, easy peasy, lemon greasy. Now we got to Hyper Dragonoid Ventus. They never did a Ventus, um, Hyper, um, Ventus Drago Core. They only did Pyrus, uh, Pyrus, Chaos, Arliss, and Diamond. Whereas the Titan one, they did, uh, Pyrus, Chaos, Ventus, Darkest, and, um, Diamond. I know how to get all of those diamonds in a single, Pyrus is in a single, the darkest one's in a single, the Chaos is in a three pack, and then this one is in this pack. So I just need two more. I've seen literally I've had I went to my local one, I found like seven of those things on the shelf. I didn't pick them up. Um one because they weren't really that popular. So can't really sell them. Manual parts are the uh technically the wings, as you can see. The horn and the arms. I wish they went more forward, but I can't get past those thick thighs. So yeah, pretty cool. I gotta say, um, this is amazing. Uh, you guys know I love my hyper drag, my Titan Dragon Ring. Pretty cool. Again, I wish they did the others. You know they did. Um, how cool they did the others, stuff like that. I kind of wish they did, but nah. The wings are too far up. Oh, there we go. Yeah, that's how they have them. So pretty cool. Again, it's literally the same thing as folding regular Dragonoid. Sorry, try to keep camera. I'm actually looking into getting a camera. Literally, it's literally the exact same thing. I fold it a bit differently. So all it is is literally the same thing. You just you just have an extra segment on the the tail. You just have um, God, which one is it? Um, I think it's this one. I'm pretty sure. Uh. It's this extra um, segment on it. I don't have the one. All I have next to me is the Armored Alliance one, which I'm not going to get into. So pretty cool, Ventus. Ventus is my second favorite one. Uh, my third favorite one next to Pirates and Darkest. Uh, Pirates and Darkest Brawler for Life. So pretty cool. The arrow is right there. So Boxing and Brawl. And it did the thing that everybody hated about the original. It just launched the core off. That's why they changed the wings. Because the wings. That's why they have that extra fold. You guys, I, I've. Uh, ladies, too. I'm just like, I've complained about that far enough. Uh, I think every uh, Baku tuber has done that. They've complained about that. So, arrow right there. Back up. Oh, it almost did. So, yeah, pretty cool. So overall, as you can see, it's not like the usual fashion of having uh, the buck on a stand. I don't have an extra one because, like I said, these are thirty dollars retail, uh, like thirty one, thirty two dollars with tax. But they're worth it, you know. Uh, two ultras are about uh, eighteen dollars. Uh, six, six, six. Uh, sorry, six, twelve, eighteen. You know, you're basically getting a free buck on all this. But yeah. 
Um, out of the two, I gotta say between this one and the the Arlo's Clop Tour one, I'm kind of leaning towards the all uh the Clop Tour one because the thing is this: uh, an Aquas, uh, an Arlo's Bakugan, they're rare. You get a core, but you know I have a I have multiple Phaedruses. Uh, I have these Bakugan in my collection, not these specific uh, factions. I think Kubo, I actually have a Darkest Kubo. Uh, well, I know Darkest Kubo comes at a 340, which I've yet to find. Because uh, the only place that has them is Target, and Target's doing crap. Um, you know, Phaedrus, uh, I think there's other ways to get Phaedrus. Hey, Alice, um, Cindy, as I've seen three packs of them. Uh, you know, these two, they're exclusive to this set, as my focus is not... Uh, is on my lights. Pandox is the star of the show because, like I said, I don't have this Bakugan in my collection. You know, I have Goreen. I, you know, but I have, you know, Dragonoid. Yeah, it is that segment. It's um, this segment right here that's different. Sorry. Um, you know, I have, you know, Dragonoid. I don't have a Ventus one, but, you know, I don't have a Pandox in my collection. I've had, I found Pandoxes, but never really picked them up. I didn't have the time or the money. <laughs> With what's been going on there. I uh, hope you guys have enjoyed this video. I know it's been a while since I have posted anything. I do apologize about that. I've um, just been going through a lot because of my job. I'm an essential worker. I work at a grocery store. Um, it's just been tiresome. I'm At one point, I worked every single day. So, uh, my paycheck was good that week. <laughs> but, yeah, no, um, yeah, i just been extremely exhausted from my job. Uh, a little upset that I had to close the shop up because I can't get nothing for the shop. I can't, uh, I can't shop online because they don't make money. I can't ship stuff. I can't get packages to deal because it would take two to three weeks. If I need it now, it'll, you know, the person now has to wait and then has to immediately ship it out. I might not be able to ship it out the day I get my packaging machine here. So, okay, so if you enjoyed this video, remember to like, comment, subscribe, do all that fun, Jesse Jess stuff. And remember, I was Kimber Brawling. I will see you all in the next video. Later, brothers.